Oh my goodness, you guys. Who is ready to rock and roll? I am so incredibly excited that you're here. I want to give out a shout out to my girl, Tina, who's in the house. And I see Ari. Hello, hello, my friend. When you guys jump on, say hi. So I know that you're here and I know that you are ready to play your Instagram because we are going to be teaching. I'm going to be teaching you guys all the things. I'm so super excited. So when you hop on, say hi. So I know that you're here. I know you're watching and I'm super pumped to get this party started. We have been getting this party started. As you guys know, if you were on a little early, I had some music rocking out because what we are doing is we are setting the tone for what is going to happen here, right here today and over the next three days. Are you guys pumped? Let me turn down my volume on my phone so that you guys are not hearing the echo. So if you are pumped, let me know what is your, are you pumped? What is your word that you are so excited about learning how to slay your Instagram here in 2022 and beyond because we are gonna rock it out. So for those of you who are just jumping on, I used to believe I used to believe that in order for me to be able to sell on social media or to be able to rock it out, you know, rock out my brand, get the sales, find the clients, I was watching a whole lot of different people out there. That in order to slay my social media, I had to do all of the things, right? I got really good at looking around at all of these tactics right? Maybe um, boost your algorithm, get the algorithm on your side, right? To learn how to perfect a transition in my reel, because that's what all the people are doing. These people with like a million followers are doing, they're learning how to transition their reels. Or I thought that maybe I had to get a hundred billion thousand quadrillion followers. And somehow that was going to equate to the cash that was showing up in my bank account. But the hard fact was, the hard reality of that was that I can perfect every single tactic out there. I could get the perfect lettering, get the fonts right, get the colors right, land that that ideal avatar, get that avatar down to the point where I know her name. I know that she loves mocha, schmocha, frappuccinos from Starbucks. I know that she likes to do yoga, you know, all of these things. I could perfect the tactics. I could perfect the reels. I could get my hashtag game on points. I could get my fonts. I could have the beautiful pink background, I could have everything look perfect. But the thing that I was missing, the thing that I was missing was the most important piece that was the strategy behind it. Because you can have the most beautiful brand in the world. You can have 100 billion quadrillion followers out there. You can do every single thing you want to do to like get your count up, get your views up, get your, you know, your reach, all of these things. But if you are in a business, if you are in a business, the goal is to convert that following into cash money. Are you guys feeling me here? If you have a business, the goal is to make money, right? Even though Sometimes sales can feel hard. Sales can feel like, you know, all of the things, sleazy, you know, cushy, whatever that is. And we'll talk about that as well. We'll talk about selling on, on social, but, you know, we can have all of those things, but if we have a business, the goal is to make money because you have a business, not a hobby. You have a business not a hobby. So if you have tried all the things like I had, if you've done, 
you know, this tactic and this tactic and you built the reels and you did the graphics and you've done a million quadrillion finding your avatar worksheets and you've done this and you've done that and you're spinning your wheels and you're just kind of throwing things out there randomly. And you're like, where is this going to convert? This has to work. Then you are in the right place. You are in the right place. For those of you who do not know me, I know there are a ton of people who signed up for this training that I am so incredibly excited to get to know. This is our first interaction. This is our first time meeting each other. Then hello, my name is Val Nichols. I am a business coach and mentor for multi-passionate, heart-centered entrepreneurs. My heart is with the people who are you know, entrepreneurs and business leaders who not only want to create you know, that amazing, incredible income, they wanna create the financial freedom and they wanna create amazing impact as well. They are driven by something that's bigger than themselves. They know that they know that they know in their hearts that you know, they want to make this business work. They wanna make their business work because they are doing something that's so much bigger than themselves. They want to help other people. They wanna show up and create impact and they want to create amazing income just like you. So hello, I'm so excited to meet you guys. I've been reading over when you signed up, you guys gave me some information about you and I'm just so incredibly excited to extend my welcome and appreciation to you. And just know that um, we are going to go over a ton of information over the next three days. So we are going to go over all the things, right? Like um, we're going to talk about your big, bold, beautiful, juicy, seductive vision for your business, because that is the foundation of what we are creating here. In day two, we're going to go over the actual like Instagram, what's working, the reels, the stories, the highlights, the Instagram live, the feed, the carousels, all of those details that will help you to propel your business forward to attract your dream clients and ultimately to put more cash in your pockets. Why? Because there is plenty of room at the top. And my goal for you at the end of this three days is we're going to do a little bit of information and then you'll put it into place. A little bit of information and then you put it into place. This way, you will be able to see massive results by the end of this training. And you'll walk away going, oh my gosh, this is incredible information. I'm already seeing the traction. And, you know, then I will offer you guys, you know, what a next step is. If you're interested in that, we will also go over the basics of social selling. This is huge, right? Because if you, again, if you have like all the tactics down, but you don't actually have a strategy that is leading your clients to something, right? This is one of the biggest missing pieces that I see out there. This is one of the biggest miss missing pieces that is being taught in social media strategy is what is the actual, like, what are you leading your clients to? What is the sale? And you will know how to do that when you walk away from here. And so you'll be like, sweet, let's do this. Right? So I'm pumped. I don't know about you guys, but this is going to be such an amazing, fun, incredible three days. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to hang out with you guys, get to know you better, get to know your businesses better. And also know that I love people who are into action. So I'm gonna share something very exciting in just a couple of minutes, but I love the action takers. And what I like to do behind the scenes is I like to teach you how to get into action and to get into completion energy. What I mean by that, this is like a buzzword of mine, but the completion energy means that if you are the type of person who is maybe your ADHD, or maybe you, um, you know, have a lot of different, you're multi-passionate, right? So what happens is it's really easy to get into this idea of like starting, stopping, starting, stopping, right? We can start all the things, but actually getting into completion energy is where we lack. So there will be certain prompts and ideas and incredible things that I'm going to be sharing with you guys to help propel you and to give you the upper hand in your business. So if you guys are excited about that, let me know in the comments right now, if you are pumped and you are ready to move forward in a powerful way, let me know that you are committed. Let me know that you are all in and let's get this party started. If you're ready, let me know. I don't wanna move forward without you guys. So let me know in the comments, are you ready?
to get this start party started, what are you excited about? Also, could you guys let me know in the comments, can you put your Instagram handles? Because I will be offering something really exciting today. Um, so if you can put your Instagram handles in the comments, that way I can look at them. Um, I might not look at them during the training, but I definitely want to have my eyes on your guys' Instagram handles. So put them in there. If we're not following each other, I want to follow you. So put it in the comments as well. Let me get this pumped up. Ooh. Mm, okay. My friend is calling me during this training and hopefully it is not interrupting you guys. I hope it's not interrupting all y'alls. All right, let's get this pump started right now. Hold on. Right, guys, I wanna know that you are ready. I wanna know you're pumped. So let me know in the comments that you are ready. Unless we will not move forward. Oh, I'm seeing some people are ready. Awesome, perfect. And let me know your Instagram handles as well so that I can be sharing that in the comments. And I'm seeing Nathan's message come through. Dude, super excited to be rocking it out with you. Okay. All right. Hopefully you guys can see my screen. You can see everything we've got going on. So welcome to the Instagram and Slay Masterclass. Guys, I'm pumped. This is your official welcome. This is your official welcome to the amazing party. We are gonna rock it out over the next three days. I'm seeing some amazing, incredible people. Um, will you be able to watch this later? Yes, Patty, absolutely. You can watch this later. Um, you are absolutely, oh, oh my gosh. Ari, thank you so much for putting me in your Instagram stories. You rock, dude, you rock. All right, welcome to day one. We are gonna talk about your big, bold, juicy, delicious, seductive vision. The reason why vision is so important is because it is really easy to throw things randomly out there. It is so easy to throw things out into the internet world, onto the Instagram page without having a strategy, a tactic, and a vision. Every single thing I do in my company is intentional. Every single post I put out, every training I do on Clubhouse, Instagram, Facebook, uh, email marketing, everything I put out has intention behind it. It is leading my customers somewhere. And the reason why my customers can go on the journey with me, my potential clients can go on the journey is that I have a big, bold vision. So today we're gonna to talk about vision and you're gonna be able to map yours out. So grab your pen and paper if you don't have it yet. Ari, ready, I have Val Envy. Oh my gosh, I freaking love you. Hashtag I have Val Envy, I love it. All right, so in this training, you will learn how to use your content to sell more. Who wants to learn that? Let's learn how to use our content to actually sell. You're gonna learn how to monetize your social media and what platform is best for you. You're gonna know your audience and their needs and you're gonna learn how to provide value to your ideal clients so that you can sell on your social media without feeling sleazy, salesy, pushy, any of those things. We do not do that anymore, okay? So whatever whatever ideas you've had about sales in the past, we're gonna push that off because we can learn how to sell an authentic, heartfelt, heart-centered way that leads your clients on a journey because here's the secret I wanna share with you guys. Everyone loves to buy. Everyone loves to buy. Nobody wants to be sold to. Think about Amazon. Everyone loves to buy but no one wants to feel like they are being sold to. 
you are in the right place if you, cause I don't want to waste your time. So know if this is where you are to be. If you are looking to grow your Instagram brand, your reach and your impact. If you want to attract your ideal clients on Instagram, if you want to monetize your following, this is huge. Again, you can have like 200 followers and make an $11,000 a month. I did that in my Facebook group when I first grow, was growing my business online in 2018. So just know it's not about the numbers. I'm not going to teach you to go out and increase your following and do all these things and get all these people that probably aren't your ideal client. What I'm going to teach you act your ideal client that actually wants what you have so that you can make money. If you want to make that great impact and amazing income in your business, then you are in the right place. So let me know if this is you, if you are in the right place. So why should you listen to me? Right. You're like, okay, there's this girl on Facebook. And I don't know. She's saying all these things, but just know that I have built my six figure business. I'm a business coach and mentor for heartfelt, heart-centered entrepreneurs just like you. I have built my business 100% through organic social media strategy. That's it. It was very heavy on the Facebook groups and Facebook only for years. And since the algorithm is kind of junk right now on Facebook, as you've noticed, Instagram has been the top producing platform for my company. Um, for the last like six months, we hit our biggest milestone ever in October after taking an entire month off. I took the entire month of September off, came back with a strong resolve that I wasn't going to play small anymore. I was going to go all in and I was going to allow myself to hit the next level that month using the strategy that I'm going to teach you guys in this program. The strategy I used on Instagram, we hit a, a $34,000 month in October and now we are um, using Instagram to hit consistent 10 to $15,000 months on Instagram alone. That's not including email marketing, upsells, repeat customers, programs. Like this is just coming from our Instagram following, which we know because of our numbers. So I'm a, a speaker. I have ADHD. I am a serial entrepreneur, an Aquarius, in case you're wondering. Um, I'm a dreamer, a rebel. And an entre woo, entrepreneur creator. Yes, I create other entrepreneurs. I believe in the impossible. So if you're the type of person like me, who's a little bit of a dreamer and a rebel and you don't want to fit into a box, you refuse to be defined by your circumstances, your past, your, um, you know, whatever that is, your, your ADHD diagnosis, your whatever, fill in the blank. If you refuse to be defined and you refuse to listen to anyone that will tell you you have to stick to one thing, one program, one offer, and sell that for the rest of your life. If you are like, oh, that gives me anxiety and makes me feel trapped, you're in the right place. And I want to remind you guys too. Um, so I want to incentivize you guys. I want to incentivize you as well too. Right now or anytime during this training, just like Ari did. Be like Ari, hashtag be like Ari. Ashley says, yes, 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 yes. If you take a screenshot of this at any time, any part of this training and share it on your Instagram, we're gonna take action, right? Like, because success leaves clues, be an action taker. I would so very much appreciate it if you took a screenshot of any points in this training today, and you tag me on Instagram, my team is going to be watching. So make sure you tag me. My handle is, let me write it here in the comments so you guys have it. It's at, it's Val Nichols on Instagram. That's my tag. So tag me in it. I'm going to be giving away an Instagram audit every day of this training. What that means is I'm going to look at your Instagram before we meet I will look at your Instagram and I'm going to know exactly what you need to tweak in order to attract your ideal clients. So then we're going to get on a call. We'll spend about 20, 30 minutes. I'll learn a little bit more about you, what you offer, what your ideal client is, what your business is, what your strategy is, what your goal is. And then I'll give you exactly what to do to, you know, really up level your Instagram to the next level. That's going to include your bio, your links, 
your strategy. Um, we'll walk through certain things if that's what you want to do, but just know that I'm going to be giving one away each and every single day. So for today, I'm going to give away one Instagram strategy for everyone that's on live. And then if you are watching on replay, tag me because tomorrow I will also give another way another one. And there's going to be a big, exciting thing at the end that you could win as well. So if we don't draw your name today, you can absolutely go into the pool for the next time. So go ahead, take your screenshot and you could win big. I love you guys. All right. And remember, like I said, action takers reap the rewards. You will get 100% of what you show up for. Percent of what you show up. The more you participate, the more results you will get. The more you participate in this training, the more results you're going to get. Because what I'm going to teach you is a little bit of action, and then you go implement it right away. And this is going to help you to, you know, see those results and to build on the foundation that we're building here. So if you guys agree with that 100%, put 100% in the comments and say, I'm ready. I want to show up 100%. I'm here. I'm ready. Let's take action. All right. So first off, Let's define your ideal clients. You might have said, but Val, I've done this a million times. Trust me. Trust me. I will lead you into your results. So trust me. <laughs> Shit, that was a lot of words to type. Yes, it was. Lots of words to type. It sure was. All right. So who is your ideal client? right? This is going to get into your big, bold, beautiful, juicy vision. We want to be able to nail down the right strategy to attract your ideal client. So who is your ideal client? What gender and age range are they? And also what is your expertise that you are teaching them, right? This is important for knowing who your ideal client is, because if I'm teaching business, I don't want to be putting a, a bunch of like random, crazy, like, you know, reels out there that are fun and, you know, like look great. If I'm not actually like teaching what my expertise is, how can I help them? And I know it's easy to say like, well, I don't want to put a limitation. I don't want to limit myself. I don't want to define an ideal client because then I'm going to just limit all these people. And I say this with kindness and love. That is a lack mentality. That is a lack mentality. I too have gone through that struggle myself and just know that as you evolve and grow, so will your ideal clients and your message can change depending on who you're talking to. I used to work exclusively with women. For a while in my business, I started out as an executive coach in 2013, 2013, I was working with people who were either, um, you know, going from employee to higher level management, you know, bankers. Um, I worked with one guy that was like a retired NFL like player, and he was transitioning into a new thing. I've worked with people who were kind of on the brink of being fired and something needed to change. So I would come in and I would either like help them clean house, figure out what they need to do. Um, you know, offer that person some strategy on how to change their behavior and how they approach their client or how they approach their staff, or they would be, you know, kind of like the last resort. So I chose at a point that I would only work with women, you know, just in a certain area. But now, you know, like I work with men again, I've worked with teams, um, couples, men and women. I've um, opened that door up again to work with men who are you know, multi-passionate who want to really define their clients who want to make that great impact and money. So, you know, just know that this is something that can change. So how do they consume content? This is a very important piece because you want to know how your ideal client likes to consume content and just know, you know, there's some people that are going to scroll, like scroll through the reels. There are other people who love to watch the short little stories. They love to see your content. And you can actually go up and see who is 
following your stories and just know that those people that are showing up every single day watching your stories, they have interest, right? Interest equals impact, right? They are your ideal client because if you implement the right strategy, leading them, they are saying, I want to be here. I'm, I'm showing up every day. I'm looking at your stories. I have people in my life that go, Val, oh my gosh, I love going to your Instagram every single day because I can't wait to see what you have going on in my stories. They love to see what I'm talking about, what I'm putting out there. And they're like, it's like my little, like every day, every morning before I dive into work, I love to see the little episode of what you have going on, what you're doing, what you're teaching, what you're talking about. It inspires me. It motivates me. It educates me. So those are the, you know, you want to be looking at how do they like to receive content? Maybe your clients are more like, you know what? I love your content, but just DM me. I want to be in the DMs. This is more of like your analytical to the point people who don't have time to be on Instagram as much, but you want to make sure you're leading them to your Instagram and then to your DMs, which we will talk more about tomorrow and on day three, um, you know, leading people to your DMs and that's where you sell, right? So if, if that might sound a little scary right now, but just know you're going to do it in a very authentic, in a very real way that is going to feel good for you and for your clients. And then lastly, what are your goals? What is your goal? What are you selling or leading them to? This could be a product. This could be a service. You know, what is your product suite? What I mean by that is what is your offers? Do you have low, mid, and high offers so that you have that array, your product suite, I call it, um, so you have an array of offers where people can join in, you know, like I have a, a mastermind group that is like kind of a lower level offer. It's, it's very affordable. You can get some support. You can get the um, accountability you need. Then there's also like mid-level offers. Like um, I have an Instagram a course that I have. I also have like mid-level um, masterminds. This is more for like clients who've worked with me before and now they're still in that area of, you know, wanting the accountability, wanting the support, wanting the current training. And then I have my high level offers, which are, um, you know, like I have retreats, we have one-on-one -on -one coaching, but there's like a whole array. So if someone comes to me and they're like, okay, you know, one-on-one -on -one coaching, maybe I'm not ready for that yet, but you know, what else do you have to offer? And I can put them in a place where it'll feel good. It will be, um, great for their growth in their business. It'll help get them the results they need so that they can make that cash injection. And then boom, let's talk about working one-on-one -on -one so we can go deeper in your strategy, deeper in your tactic, deeper in defining your company and what your offers are, right? So just know that each one of us are going to have a different goal. If you watched my 2022 training then you saw, I, I talked about, you know, each one of us having your different goals of how to define your yearly goals, break that down into quarterly goals, monthly goals, and then defining your product suite. So now you know exactly what to focus on in your Instagram, because again, we don't want to be random, right? I used to get so confused when I heard people say that, but, you know, now knowing what I know, that, you know, that randomness, just kind of throwing random offers out there, not having a strategy, a follow-up or a way that I'm nurturing my clients means that I was leaving a crap ton of money on the table, right? Just know that there's always a strategy to follow. And this is going to help you define that. All right. So one of the biggest ways that you want to be focusing on in your Instagram in 2022 is providing value, providing value. There are people that I've been talking to who've actually reactivated their Instagram accounts or have started an Instagram account because now there's so much value with reels, educational reels, with carousels that people are, you know, like they want to, they want to save all that content. They want to consume that content. So think about that. The four things you want to do with your clients or your ideal audience is educate, entertain, inspire, and motivate them to action. So someone write that in the comments, educate, entertain, 
inspire and motivate to action. And so what we wanna do is we wanna be providing value because the more people like, comment and share your Instagram post, like, comment and share, the more you're gonna be seen on their algorithm, the more you're going to get traction and the more they're gonna keep coming back for more. So how we do that is we provide value. So how we do that is you can do steps they can take. This can be either in a, a, a content, like a reel, or I'm sorry, um, a carousel. That's where you're seeing like the difference you're swiping through. You guys wanna do about eight. We've um, tested it quite a bit and you know play around with it yourself, but we've learned that about eight different slides has been the top producing of um, getting it into people's, into their feeds, letting it be seen. So just know that you can do like a step-by-step -step process they can take to get to a solution. Maybe it's how you make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Here's the eight steps, right? You can do three to five steps max. So that is three to five ideas or steps max. Because anything more than that, our brains cannot hold them right? Have you ever had that where it's like a fire hose and you're like, oh my gosh, so much information that I can't even like comprehend or understand it. So you want to do three to five steps max on eight carousels. So that could be you're introducing the problem, how to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Then real number two, or slide number two, um, peanut butter sandwiches are amazing. They're healthy. They're nutritious. They provide a lot of uh, protein number, you know, the next one is, but then provide three to five steps, actions that they can take. Make it simple and easy to understand. The easier, the more simplistic, the better, right? If you're on a reel, you have about like 15 seconds to capture someone's attention, to give them the, that three to five points, and then to be done. We don't have a lot of attention span anymore. We don't. You can also share behind the scenes looks of you building courses. Maybe you're learning new things. Maybe you're learning on, maybe you're creating a new line of jewelry. I know Tina's on here. So, you know, like maybe you're creating your jewelry or you're at one of your events and you are, um, you know, sharing some behind the scenes looks. Think about your business or your life. If you are a lifestyle brand, if you are um, in any sort of business, just think about you, you are selling a script right? It's called the reels for a reason. It's like you're giving people a reel of what you do, a behind the scenes look, and everyone wants the rights to this movie, right? So think of that. You're, you're showing them what you're doing throughout the day. You're helping them to understand what it's like to be in your brand. You're educating them. You're giving them information. Um, maybe you are, you know, you have a process and you're kind of walking them through what that process looks like. And then you're also sharing your wins and testimonials, which we're gonna get deeper into tomorrow about how to create your wins and your testimonials in a way that is going to sell for you, right? But you wanna be sharing testimonials of clients or feedback you get, um, maybe even like testimonials of the transformation you've provided to yourself if you don't have those clients yet. You also wanna share your knowledge. You wanna position yourself as someone who can help them. Position yourself as someone who can help them. One of the biggest points I want you guys to walk away with here is don't try to impress others in your industry. You're not there for your competition. You're not there to see who makes the best reel, who does the best transition, who gets the most follows. You are there to speak to your ideal client and to meet your ideal client exactly where they're at now. I have made this mistake so many times in my company in the beginning of bringing my company online. I would talk about these things that people didn't understand, right? Like um, even saying something like a sales funnel or your biggest value proposition, or, you know, like you want to do this. There's a lot of industry terms out there that your client might not understand. So, you know, meet them where they're at, meet them where they're at and try not to be looking around so much at what all of your competition is doing that now you start creating a patterned look where people are like, 
oh, I'm so bored with everything that's out there. Because what happens is a lot of times like um, business coaches will try and impress other business coaches or, you know, like one up them or do something that they're doing, but do it bigger or better or different. And really like, I'm not selling like my clients, your clients doesn't care what the other people are doing. What they care about is how you are going to, to help them. And if you can meet them exactly where they're at. All right, guys, here is your action step for today. I want to know, how will you add value to your ideal clients today? What will you do today on your Instagram or for the next 24 hours? How will you add value? And I would love to hear what are your top three valuable topics. And if you need help with this, let me know. You can also use the group, the wild tribe group, um, for support, just tag me. So I see it and say, um, you know, I'm having trouble finding out what my valuable topics are. I'm ha you know, if I'm, if you're having troubles finding out, like, how can you provide value to your clients? Let me know. I'm here for you. I'm here to support you. So how will you add value to your ideal clients today? I would love to know in the comments. I'm going to watch you guys over here. Um, I have you guys here. And then I have you on my, my lat or my, what is it called? Cell phone. That's a really hard word. Cell phone. I have you on my cell phone so that I can see you and um, the comments you guys are giving. Oh, oh my gosh, Ari, you are too amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wow. That was fancy. Look at you. Wow, Ari's got it going today. So what are the three topics that you are going to provide value in? And what are the topics that you are going to share on your Instagram today? Be thinking about that because, you know, this is a program of action. We are going to take action as we're going through this. You can start seeing the results. If that sounds good to you, Give me a yes or a hell yes in the comments, either a yes or a hell yes, because we're going to rock this out. So what are the three topics you are going to do to provide value? This is your homework for tonight. Don't forget to either snap a photo of your Instagram. Um, I'm sorry, snap a photo of this training, snap a photo of your homework, whatever that is, tag me in it because we're going to be giving away a ton of awesome prizes throughout this training. And Tamara, if you are on here, let me see if she's on here. Um, oh, there you are. You're on my Zoom. Huh, I'm such a dork. So yes, if you are on here, you're on here. Let me know. She's looking at the Instagram. Who our winner is for today. Random person. Oh, hey. I didn't even see Brett was on here. Hello, Michaela. Tina. What's up, Patty? Elaine. Ari, Ashley, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much for being here. So don't forget, what are your three topics that you are going to provide value with today on your Instagram? What are three things that you can share and think about too in a different way, right? So often I like to look at like, what are the things in the industry that piss me off that people are teaching that are like, totally wrong, right? I've seen so many people in the couple of years I've been here. And again, you guys, I've had a business since I was 11 years old. So it's been decades, right? Like I've been building out businesses for decades, corporate businesses, my own businesses. And I see people all the time that are like, well, I started a business and I couldn't make any money. So I'm going to go teach other people how to start their businesses. And I'm like, That's great, but if you couldn't make money in your own business, how are you going to lead your clients to make money in their business? You know, like the, it doesn't really make sense. So um, just like, look at those types of things. Like what kind of value can you bring? What kind of topics can you talk about? And often that stuff you're extremely passionate about. It's stuff you see going on in the industry you're in that is, is like detrimental, is wrong, fires you up whatever that is, that is great topics to look at because the more passion you have about it, 
the better it's going to be. So the more passion you have about that piece of content, the more it's going to draw people in because they're going to know your passion. They're going to know your energy. They're going to know your vibe. So define your ideal client. Think about how do they like to consume information? What valuable topics can you bring to the table and create content around that? Tomorrow, we're going to talk a lot more about the different modalities of Instagram. We're going to talk about reels, IG lives. We're going to talk about, you know, hashtag strategies. We're going to talk about um, the, the carousels, the static posts, you know, all the different ways that we can really dive in and start defining our Instagram strategy. It's going to be a lot of great information. So don't miss it. We'll be back here tomorrow at 2 p.m. Pacific. 5 p.m. Eastern. Do not miss it. It is going to be amazing. I can't wait to hear what you guys come up with. And join me back here tomorrow. Same time, the same place. It is going to be amazing. I am so appreciative of you guys. If you have any questions, please do let me know in the comments right now. So, or, and if you are watching this on replay or you have other questions, just know you can come back to this and ask questions or just post it in my group, post it in the wild tribe. You can also message me on Instagram. Um, I haven't been on there like since Thursday because I took an entire day off on Friday. It was off the grid. It was amazing. And so I've been off all of my social uh, everything. I've been off everything all weekend. But um, just know I will get back to you guys. I love you so very much. And with that, we have a winner. Let me look at my comments here. Me. You win for today. Congratulations. Yay. Instagram strategy. Perfect. So I'm gonna look at your Instagram. I know you, so this is a good, you know, good where to start. But let's schedule a 20, 30 minute consultation or call. And then we can work on exactly what your strategy is and what you are doing in the social media and in the Instagram world. Super pumped. I'm writing that down. Congratulations. And just know, you guys, I'm going to give away another Instagram strategy session. And then also on Wednesday, and then we're going to be sharing with you some next steps. And we're also going to share with you an amazing, incredible announcement, a big prize. So keep tagging, share, share, like everywhere you can on your Instagram stories. I would love for you to do that. Um, and not going to miss the entire class because I was too busy posting. <laughs> I love it. All right, guys, I love you so much. Thank you so much. Now go take action before you lose the momentum we've gained today. Go take some action. Look at your Instagram. Be start implementing this strategy and join me back here tomorrow. Do not miss a second because we're going to get deeper into the actual like Instagram, the things, the reels, the strategy, all of that. I love you guys. I will see you tomorrow. Same time, same place. Mwah! Bye.